All right, let's do a, a shift gears a little bit from molecular to anatomic. And who thought we would go in that direction? Um, but it seems that right and left are different cancers. Um, uh, Dale, why don't you, I haven't picked on you in a while, why don't you kind of summarize what those findings were um, and we'll talk a little bit how they apply to us clinically. Yeah, I mean, you know, so clinically, we, I mean, we know that they are different biology. I mean, that's become really clear with the, you know, subset analysis of 8045 and, you know, that patients that respond differently to GFR therapies. We know they, that there's differences in terms of likelihood that of peritoneal, you know, mets or liver mets, um, you know, left-sided tumors, patients live, you know, longer. With Are you exception. telling your patient you got right-sided, you know, get your affairs in order? You know, we, we I, I, in all fairness, don't. I don't I mean, either. <laughs> I don't either. In all fairness, we don't, <laughs> right? And so we sort of globally know that there's differences, mm. but I still don't think we're at the level where we understand it enough to, to make those sorts of decisions and, and comment on that. Yeah. I was going to just chime in real quick and say that I think it's important to keep in mind that that trial was specifically in the treatment-naive metastatic patient mm. population. Correct. So large part of the data is that, treatment-naive patients. That's, that's exactly some right. Subsequent There's studies, some yeah. other smaller studies. But but most of what we know, you're exactly right, is that it, with that first that first therapy, and and I think a lot of the differences in terms of what we do depends on sort of the algorithm you use to treat that that patient initially, that first line therapy. And so I tend to give VEGF therapy um, usually as first line. And so it doesn't matter as much about the, the lower response rates mm. um, to right-sided colon with EGFR agents. So um, I think it depends, that, that's where I think it depends more on from a practical standpoint in terms of changes in biology. Yeah, so let's, we'll get to therapy in a minute. Michael, I'm gonna pick on you on this. Mm -hmm. Is there any clue about what's going on here? Why would anatomically right be different from anatomically left? Uh, we're knowing more about you know, the CMS uh, consists of molecular right. subtype uh, panels and, and the like, and RAS and BRAF and MSI. Is there any clue here of what's going on, to your knowledge? Uh, yes, but to be fair, many of these things don't always pan out when one looks further. So uh, we know that uh, obviously embryologically they're different, so there is a reason to believe that the biology can be different. There have been some limited analysis done, even on normal colon, to look at gene expression is you move along the colon and it does vary uh, from the left side to the right side of the colon. So the normal tissues have some difference. Um, one of the more interesting uh, observations has been that um, uh, in right-sided tumors, uh, there tends to be um, a lower expression of uh, the ligands for EGFR, amphiregulin and epiregulin um, because of, um, of um, methylation patterns, and in that situation, you can imagine certainly that if there isn't adequate ligand, then it's not a driver for the pathway. So of course, an anti-EGFR therapy might not work. Of course, again, that's really based on one analysis and, um, you know. Uh, Johanna, picking on you, where is the right end and where does the left begin? <laughs> Embryologically, you divide at the splenic flexure, so usually the transverse in these analyses have gone along mm. with the right side. Yeah, but I've even heard some people say, well, if it's a little bit over here, it's a little bit over there. But so I, I joke, because I'm a division chief and I have to make sure everybody puts in the correct ICD-10 code, but you need to put in the correct ICD-10 mm. code. I could imagine a day when, you know, payers would say, well, you can't do that drug because it's uh, right-sided, yeah. right?